Nutrition is very important, whether it's human or for plants, same way. So my one of my research component is seeing how does each greening affected trees need more different type of nutrition or more amount of nutrition. So I'm doing a few trials with fertilizers, be micronutrients, which are like the smaller nutrients that are required in small amount and then major nutrients which are like nitrogen, potassium. So I'm just trying to see how these nutrition are affecting, how can we rehabilitate the trees. That's one of a big trial and if we can find the perfect balance of these nutrition that can be readily applied and growers can get help. We have seen that growers who have a better nutrition program, their trees are slightly better. So trees do have greening, it's always there. but trees are still able to maintain their health and produce a, a decent amount of fruit. So it is important and that's what we are trying to do. Uh, there is a team of researchers here with me who are looking into nutrition. So we are trying our best to find out guidelines or recommendations for growers. Like I mentioned, we are doing some, um, we are doing a nutrition trial and this trial is funded by CRDF and what CRDF is the Citrus Research Development Foundation and um, what we are doing is we are comparing some fertilizers like we are seeing how trees will respond and we are collecting leaf nutrient samples, soil nutrient samples so before we start the experiment we see where the trees are, what is the base level and then throughout the course of experiment we'll see how trees are responding. In addition to nutrient analysis we are also doing PCR which is to detect the amount of bacteria that is there in the tree. Right now uh, my biological scientist Taylor Livingston she is actually collecting the leaf sample midrib so bacteria resides in a part of a leaf. So she's trying to cut that part out and then we will eventually do a DNA extraction and then we will quantify the amount of bacteria that is present in those samples. So that's what is happening right now our efforts that we have seen an improvement in groves uh, there is no bullet silver bullet yet there is no one solution but um, we have seen if you have a good psyllid control psyllid is the vector for the disease so if you have a good psyllid control you are taking good care of your tree from fertilizer point of view and you are doing good grove management practices grow some groves are doing good so yeah there is no silver bullet People are trying maybe some antibiotics or bactericidal, they might have potential, um, but with the good r tolerant varieties of citrus and good psyllid control and good growth management practices, uh, we can manage, um, we can sustain the industry.